Hi everyone, welcome back to Gado. Today we will show you how to replace the front and rear cameras on the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra mobile phone. To start, we need to have the right tools to proceed with the repair which you can find in the description. First, take out the SIM tray and then the back cover removal. To remove the back cover, it needs to heat gently around the back cover edges until the paste adhesive becomes soft. For this, we are using a heating pad. Place the back cover side on the heating pad and select the mobile phone heating option and leave it till it completes. Alternatively, you can use a heat gun or hair dryer. Once the heating has completed, use a suction cup to create an opening between the frame and back cover. Next, insert a plastic car pry tool or something similar to cut the adhesive around the back cover. Take out the back cover and then pry up to undo 5 screws and then disconnect the connector to take out the wireless pad. and also disconnect the battery plug. Next, take out the logic board frame by undoing 4 screws. Next, disconnect and take out the front camera. Next, undo two screws that are secured in the board. Next, take out the logic board by disconnecting six connector plugs from the board. Be gentle and lift the board using a pry tool or tweezer. Next, disconnect and take out the 4-in-1 camera unit from the board. There are 3 connectors on the rear side on the board and one on the front side of the board. Next, take out the camera module and then take out the depth camera and ultra wide cameras from the unit. Gently using a tweezer pull out the cameras. Assume you have broken depth or wide camera then you can replace those cameras individually. But main and telephoto cameras comes as a 2 in 1 unit. Next, replace the required not working camera with a new one and then start placing it on the board. Next, place the depth and wide cameras to the camera unit and then place them on the body by connecting plugs from the board's rear side and front side.
next place and secure the logic board in the body. Next, secure six connector plugs to the board. Next, place the new front camera on the board. Next, insert the seam tray and secure the board frame by adding 4 screws. And also secure 2 screws on the logic board. Next, secure the battery plug and then place the wireless pad by securing 5 screws and connecting the plug. Next, before installing the main back cover, make sure it has enough glue. If not, use B7000 glue on your double sided back cover adhesive. Finally, we are using binding clips to tie in the back cover with the body. If not, you can use some rubber bands and leave them for some time. Hope you have enjoyed the replacement guide. Let us know if you have any questions. Please like, share and comment on our videos. Hit the subscribe button for more videos.